What's up guys? We're here in Sinaloa, Mazatla, Mexico, Lake El Salto. We're here fishing for three days total. Fishing for largemouth bass in particular. Like and subscribe to my channel, Chat Blackfish. Enjoy. Wanna give a heads up to Martin, our guide. Highly recommend the guides over here. Very experienced. We'll give you top notch advice. I'll do all the rigging for you. And here, I got a two pound bass on a wacky rig just sitting at the corner. At the point. The wacky work? Wacky worky. Yeah. And in this video, it's all catch and release, guys. We catch most of our bass and we release them back into the wild so they can grow bigger for the people who catch. It's a nice two pounder. Yeah. That's a Mexican fish. Good job. Two pound. Right on the dot. It's a fat guy. Look at that. Yeah, big belly. At this yeah, point, guys, to I decided to switch to a Carolina rig. On my first cast, I caught a fish. Decided to stick to it. And you'll see in the video upcoming, you'll see two big ones caught a Carolina rig. No mames. Está bien. Está bien. Está bien. Oh my god. Está bien. Frescas. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Fresca. You called it, babe. Beautiful. <laughs> Different. Yeah. Different. Every day different here. See. Si. Every day. Oh, this one moved to fighter. Mm -hmm. He's a good fighter, this guy. Mm -hmm. oh. Bye bye. He's tired. Yeah, he's tired. Good. <laughs> All right, guys. Here's a six pound bass. Or right, Carolina rig. Now guys, I have a 20 pound fluorocarbon line on and the 20 pound that I use is Seaguar. Uh, that's the only line I really like and I'm bad on it, man. So yeah, if you're coming down to Mexico, equip yourself with a 17 pound to a 20 pound line and you'll do all right. Sweet comfort. And she goes. Uh, there she goes. Okay. Well, this is the Texas rig. Also known as Tejas rig. Um, we didn't get much bites as we liked it. Most of the fish was just suspended, hanging around 
not biting. But here's one that I caught bouncing off a ledge. So I kind of knew I'm going to have a huge success on the Carolina rig. So I was just throwing them points and bushes, just me hooking up on a tree pounder. I knew there was a bigger one somewhere in there, and I kept fishing. Nice Kept fishing and fishing, and uh, up to this. pounder? Yeah. Pull up a, another close to a six pounder, which uh, gave me a lot of adrenaline. Sorry. And I had a lot of hopes in this lake, catching a big one. But uh, the biggest one I caught here was he got six pounder. It. But we'll come back, try to get a bigger one later. Yeah, we got a big one, guys. Yeah. Gracias. Good job. Very good job. It's long and skinny. It's long fish, it's skinny. Look at it. Oh man, this is a six pounder. Yeah. Yeah. This guy is a six pounder. So what Martin is trying to say here, it's skinny fish, just didn't have a big appetite. Massive tank go. And the tank goes away. Bye bye. Hey, thanks for watching this video, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you want to come down to uh, El Salto, Mexico, right don't forget to get in touch with these guys. Com.